Welcome back to our channel once again, my friends. Realize Guyana, home of traditional Guyanese recipes. So we are making some cook up rice today, guys. Today is Sunday, and we're gonna be doing be doing some cook up rice and some fried fish. We have some small bangamiri, which we're gonna fry up with this cook up rice. It's gonna be real yummy, real traditional Sunday Guyanese food, right? We're using the canned peas, the black eyed peas, and the kidney beans which we have here. So if you're gonna use the raw ones, if you raw black eyes, of course you're gonna have to soak it overnight, right? The usual other ingredients for a cook up rice, we have our rice there, we're gonna be using, and these are two black eye and kidney that I showed you. We're gonna be using some scallions, broadleaf thyme, onion, pepper, uh, celery, cook up seasoning, of course, and we're using the, the box coconut cream today. So that's everything for the for this cook up rice guys. It's gonna be one yummy meal today. So let's get started. So the first thing we're doing is adding some water on our stove. We're gonna start getting our seasonings ready guys, our scallion and so on. So when last you have some of this guys? Yummy cook up and fry your fish. So our onions and scallions are done cut up there already. Now to the bad boy. Full nose pepper, remember this? And we're only using a little piece, see there? This bull nose pepper is very hot. Next is our celery. Yes. So for a pack of coconut cream guys, we only gonna use half of that. Most of the times we for a cook up, we usually cook up, cook about a cup and a half or right now we are cooking about a cup and a quarter rice. So half half of this is you know. And our half of the coconut cream, we're gonna add to the water that we put to boil. So we are adding the um, the beans now, the kidney beans and the black eyed peas. We're gonna add that to boil with the coconut milk. So our black eyed peas and our kidney beans boiling away with the coconut milk there. We're gonna go wash our rice now. Adding some salt. And we're gonna also add our seasonings that we had chopped earlier. This is our board. So there's the scallions, the pepper, the celery, broadly thyme. So we're adding some Cook up seasoning now, guys. Cook up seasoning here. Some black pepper.
So we're gonna add some corrupt early bhaji guys. Yeah. We're gonna give this a good mix. Are we adding two weary weary pepper guys? You can certainly add more pepper if you want. If you like a lot of pepper. You can even add two big um scotch bonnet in here, right? If you can handle that, why not? So after we've added those stuff guys and we've give this a, a turn mixing everything there we're gonna cover this now let it cook <laughs> there you go so cutting up some broadleaf leaf thyme here we're gonna season the fish with this seasoning that we're doing now so another piece of the big bad boy there the bullnose pepper Bull nose, that's why we used to refer this pepper as bull nose pepper, the scotch bonnet. And long ago, you know, our, our um, parents and so on used to take a bite of that pepper from with each mouthful of their food, their rice and their curry. Do you have anyone in your family used to do that? I know my dad used to do that. All right guys, so we're ready to season our fish. So we have some salt, some black pepper here. And of course the stuff that we pounded here. So some nice fine manga berry. See that, this tastes so good. This can work nice with some cutters too. Some fish seasoning we added there just now. And a little touch of curry powder. And this is some flour. The green stuff is the, um, the broadly fan that we had milled up in the marker with a little piece of bullnose pepper, scotch bonnet. So that's ready for frying there, guys. So let's give this cook up a check. See what's going on. Dry it out a bit. Looking good. So here's our cook up guys, our cook up is done, looking good. There you go. So you can even dry this down more if you want to, but this is okay. As you know, it's gonna get a bit more dry once it cools up. So we're gonna remove our cook up now guys and we're gonna get working on the fried fish. The main man in the dish, fried fish. So you see we two very real pepper is still intact. So you don't have to worry that the cook up can be hot, right? So the pepper is in first. So you've added the oil there to fry our fish guys. So time to add the fish. The oil is hot.
Well, we should be able to get out of the kitchen next time. So we have turned these over now, right? Almost, almost done. Almost there. Alright guys, our fish is done. We're going to take this out now. Looking yummy, yummy, yummy. I'm going to just put them on this paper towel here. Suck up some of the oil. Cook up and fry fish is done and ready. So that's it for this video guys. Here is our fry fish in our cook up. Looking yummy yummy. So if you like this video guys, please remember to give it a thumbs up. Remember that the recipes to these dishes is going to be linked in the description box below the video. So if you like this video guys, please remember to give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Click the bell icon so you get notifications from us whenever we post new videos. Please share this video also and as always thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.